Hi, this is Mark from Wiki Design. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a YouTube playlist like this that will show the most popular videos for any YouTube channel. This is a follow up to this video right here. I'm going to leave a link in the description below and I'm also going to throw a card up here. So if you just want to click that, watch that video first, then you can come back to this video. That video is going to cover the basics on how to grab any YouTube channel ID and add the HTML code that you need to your website so you can embed the latest videos from a YouTube channel. So in this tutorial, I wanted to take it a step further and show you how you can take that same approach, but have it where you can show the most popular videos. I did not cover that in the last video, so I wanted to cover it in this video. So let's just jump right into the tutorial. So the very first thing we need to do is go to a YouTube channel that you want to pull the popular feed from. So in this case, we're going to use our channel. And if you scroll down right here on the home page, we have this section right here called popular videos. Now these sections, if you aren't aware, the YouTube creator can decide what gets displayed here. So in most cases you will see channels that have popular videos. And then down here, you can see a list of like all the videos. Now I will show you later in the tutorial, not every channel has this, but a large majority of them do. So if a YouTube channel has this one right here, just called popular videos, it's real easy to pull the code that we need. So what you need to do is just click where it says play all. So if you look up here into the URL, this is what we're going to need to copy and paste. So just go ahead and copy this right here. So it says list equals and then all this gibberish code. So now I'm going to jump into the back end of our Elementor page and show you where I can paste this code. So as you can see, this is pretty much exactly the same code I had from the other video. I did clean up a little bit, so it is a little bit cleaner looking. So the source code is really just youtube.com slash um, embed and then list equals. And all you have to do is just paste that code right here. And now it's going to display the most popular video on that channel. And so if you remember from the other video, it's real easy to just display the next three in sequence. So all you have to do is just paste that back into list equals, and then we're just going to do and index equals two. So this is our second most popular video, our third most popular and our fourth. So let me see, you can see right here equals three and then equals four. So that's it. That's how easy it is to just pull in this playlist right here and, you know, display the most popular post. So now I'm going to go back to our channel and show you how I was able to figure this out. So the way it works with YouTube is everything is basically always in a playlist. So what I mean by that is these popular videos, you may just think like when you go to videos, for example, and you see these two tabs for recently uploaded and popular, these are actually just playlist. And so I figured out after a while that YouTube is giving you the playlist ID and that's exactly what we copied and pasted before. And I'm going to give you a cool little hack too. So if you want to have, instead of most popular, you could also just change one letter in that code and it's going to show the most recently uploaded. So in this example, it's our logo challenge. So now we're back on our page. And if you remember that code was U U L P, I believe that P means popular. So if you change that just to say F, you're going to notice this is going to display the most current video instead of the most popular. So I definitely figured out that you could just change that one little letter and it, you could switch between popular and the most recent. So that's a cool little trick. So now I'm going to jump into a really big channel like Mr. Beast and show you how you can grab the same code and you know, have it work on your website. So here we are on the Mr. Beast homepage and just like our channel, he does have a playlist for the latest videos and the popular videos. So just like with ours, if you go ahead and just click play all, and then you can pause this video. And if you look right up here, this is all you need is this one little code right here. So it should always start with UULP for the most popular. So let's go ahead and drop that in and make sure that that works as well. So now if we jump into the page, I'm going to go ahead and replace that playlist with the Mr. Beast playlist, UULP. And yeah, as you can see, it's pulling in his most popular video, which is like the squid game video. So yeah, this works out perfect. And then if you want to go down here, like I said, this will now be his second most popular video. So you just replace everything up until it says and index equals. So that's his second most popular. Now I'm going to jump into a different channel that doesn't have that and show you how you can pull that in. 
So if you go to a channel like Apple, you're going to notice when you scroll down, they don't have the playlist for the most popular videos. So they have all of their different, uh, you know, devices and everything, but they do not have a popular one. So what you can do is just like we did in the very first video, we need to grab the channel ID and then we could just paste it into the back end of our website and it will work just as well. But let's go ahead and click on videos first and click on popular. So this right here is the most popular video. Um, what is it? A guided tour of iPhone 14. So as long as that will show up, then we know the code is correct. So what you need to do is you could just right click and do the page source. Just view that. And now we're going to search for that string that we had in the very first video for the channel ID. And what you can do is select the channel ID, but leave off the very first two characters. So in most cases, it's probably going to say like a UC. Leave that off and we want everything behind that. So once you do that, just copy. And now we can jump back into our page. So let's go up to the top video and remove everything after UULP. So if you see this right here, it just says UULP. Of course, nothing's going to show. So now if we paste that in, that's going to show the most popular video from YouTube. So like I said, all this is that I just pasted in was basically the channel ID. And then the way it works is UULP is always going to display the most popular videos. So just like all the other ones, you could do it in sequence. You can have the second most popular, third, fourth, whatever it may be. But I just wanted to create this video um, mainly because I'm going to forget how to do this. So I wanted to really document how to do this, but I know that a lot of you will think this is very helpful. So just wanted to create this quick video. Make sure that you give this video a like, subscribe to this YouTube channel, and hit that bell to receive notifications when I release new tutorials like this. Again, this is Mark from Wiki Design.